We have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture-perfect for a game of this nature. What are you making of this formation, Jim Beglin? Well, I can tell you, Peter, that I actually always like playing in this formation because as a wing-back, you get more freedom to go forward. As an orthodox full-back, you had to be more selective in the runs you made. The back three should be able to deal with certainly one opposition striker and, and possibly two. And that's why I liked it, because I didn't have to get back that much. So it's away we go then. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Callejon. He's the one who could shine. Um, sharp and skillful and happy to ease inside and allowing the fullback to fill the space he vacates. If an opportunity arises too, he's also a very mean free kick taker. Hard to disagree with that. It is the sort of situation he thrives in. Flanovic, Kaya Horn. Now it's Kaya Horn. And he's been booked for simulation. Listen, he can play the innocent as much as he wants, Peter, but it was fairly obvious to everyone here. He's got no hiding place. Gosnes. And it's Zapata. Daron. Zapata. Over to the left. Steered in. Luis Muriel, and he's there to cut it out. Bonaventura drives it forward. Flanovic spreads it towards the left. He's got away. Kuyame knocks one in. And that's been levered clear. The room. That intervention was very necessary to locate someone up front. Hatabor tries to get it forward quickly. Hoists it forward. And here's Zapata. Luis Muriel. Got offside that time. Keeper sends it forward. Bonaventura gets into some space. 
No messing about, just bludgeoned away. More than... The referee's awarded a free kick. Oh, and he's asking too much with that. Pulka and it's played forward Fiorentina are very keen on the aerial route look if you're good at it and instructed to and they've been caught out here ball through and Zapata oh the keeper's done ever so well Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Massive leap! Decent attempt, but not quite good enough. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Hatterbor. Deftly done. And he's there to clear it. Zapata plays it out to the wing. Gosnes pumps it into the area. And it's the road. Hits one! A decent effort as the first half draws to a close. So now the team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goalless. An engrossing half, but we're still where we started. Nil-nil. And if you're just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Atalanta can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. And it's got through. Towering header! Knocks it away. The room. Tries a shot! Defenders on the back foot. Flanovic gets wrestled off the ball. The room. Goal is still. Neither side really getting onto the front foot. It's on a plate. He's in, surely. Out to the left it goes. Played in with accuracy. Cuts it out. The room. Zapata. Bonaventura. Nil-nil the score, and we're just about done. A deeply frustrating game. Kuyame. And it's Muriel. Flanovic gets it back. Forward it goes. Now it's Muriel. Oh, shooting chance! Sticks it away! That could turn out to be a huge, huge goal! Atalanta are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven.
Atalanta. Draw first blood here. The perfect display and the old saying comes to mind when the going gets tough, etc. Duron with the challenge and he has given away a free kick. Tries his luck. Oh, that is rather wayward. Well, I can understand why his thinking was that way inclined. Tries to get it forward quickly. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Hoists it forward. Darone. He's had a shot. Oh, and that should have been two. Gosens was totally aware of how that chance could have impacted on the game, and that should have gone in. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Atalanta can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. And it's played forward. Almost there, and the players can feel it. Now it's Callejon. Right through the middle. Oh, that's a foul in a dangerous area. Some players have clearly taken issue here, and things are threatening to boil over. Oh, look, Peter, what they need now are, are cool heads and discipline, and instead it looks like they've got a liability in their side. And here's Valero, goes for goal! And that's that, Atalanta hold on, it's a narrow squeak, bit of luck, some judgement, 1-0 the score at the final whistle. Well this game looked to have 0-0 written all over it, but credit to them, they upped their game.